here we are as you can see it's absolutely huge it's huge so Today we're going to make um, this frame. It means a 40 cm drum and beat with veneer inlays. Here I have prepared the layers. The outer layer is with a veneer inlay. Then we have the middle layer and the inner layer. I use three layers for the main frame. And yeah, it's important for me to make solid wood frames, but if you make solid wood frames you might get problems that the frame can break around the wood grain. So what I do, and that's one of the things I would never tell to the public, is that I use uh, this kind of texture, wood grain, for the outer layer and a lying, or I think it's called bloomy texture for the middle one and a striped texture for the inner one again. So I get a kind of plywood effect but it's still solid wood and it's absolutely unbreakable. And now we have to cut the layers and the whole secret of my frames lies in the length of the layers and yeah that's the big secret of the workshop and yeah here are the lengths of the layers and uh, another thing I never would tell to the public, of course. So now we cut the layers with this machine. Now the, the layers have the right length. And now we simply have to get the three layers together with some glue into this mold. Yeah, how to do that? I show you. Ta-da! Um, yeah, I know it's not really the same frame, but um, this one is already finished and we don't have the time to wait for the other frame. So after gluing the other frames together the same way, the tuning rim, the intermediate rim and the main frame, and after cutting and rooting and sanding and finishing, it looks like that. And you see we have three fittings here. One is here, the inner one is here, and the middle one is here. So now we have to mount all this stuff together. As you can see I have made here a little distance between the main frame and the intermediate frame. So um, this is a kind of emergency exit if the drum should uh, get into a very very dry area on this planet and the skin would tighten too much even if the tuning system is completely loosened. So um, it would be a possibility to just open these screws and remove this inner frame so um, both frames can come closer together and the skin does not have to be removed or something like that. Yeah, as I said, it's a kind of emotion VX.
Now the frame is finished and is now waiting for the goat. Sorry. So, I hope you enjoyed my little film and um, maybe you have learned a little bit about my drums and why I'm doing what I'm doing and hopefully see you again one day maybe with my next film maybe with a title from Mummy Goat and Daddy Goat to Dragon Skin. See ya!